Hello there everybody. I wanted to uh, take a quick break from unpacking our house which is in complete and utter shambles to make you aware of this new book by Sarah Brown. Um, this I'm a science geek. I'm an engineer. This book might be one of my favorite ever and part of it is because of the tricky way that she made it, made it into something that was uh, multidisciplinary. Uh, so here we go. This is a science journal. Great for your science loving kids. Science, they pick out science books, draw the covers, get a little artwork in there, draw the science tools they're going to use, research and reading time. So you got some reading in there. And then these, these pages uh, repeat in sections. So once you get through with that, on to my experiments, observations, and discoveries. So you get a little practical, lab practical. Then we move on to biography of a scientist. So we've worked some history in there. Stories, creative writing. Perfect for the mad scientist. A study of scientists and scientific dis discoveries. Another history type activity. Spelling, gotta work some spelling in there. Next section, film, a film study, films and tutorials. So I am just speeding through here. Science projects. So there you have building, hands-on things, cooking. It has, in the beginning of this, the section, uh, talks about different ideas to get the creative juices flowing. Lots of project space in here. Then, on to record keeping charts and graphs. So we got some math worked in. Apologize, something's casting a shadow over there. As you saw, our house is in a little bit of disarray. Research essays and creative writing. Use these pages for research. Have some fun pictures. And here, the chemistry geek in me went, ooh, yay, we could color this. There's so many things we could do with this. So, periodic table, make your own. Maybe you could print out pictures of uh, elements to uh, see what they actually look like. Lots of different ways to, to write the periodic table, not just copy it, but you can do a bunch of different things with it. And extra science book cover space. And that is it. This is the Homeschooling Science Handbook. And like I said, the engineer geek in me thinks this is one of my very favorite. I cannot wait to use this with our children. They're a little young. Um, just because uh, our almost eight-year-old still has a writing aversion. But he also loves science. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give this to him and have him look at it and see what he thinks. But uh, by the time, uh, my goal is to use this with him by the time he's ten. So... Anyway, I thought I would share that with you, and now I get to get back to the sea of boxes and wrapping paper and such, which you would think would be a present, but, well, it kind of is, but it isn't, so have a good day.